Hello. In this tutorial, we're going to see how to schedule content using Recur Post. When you go to the Schedule menu, you will see all your existing schedules for each account. As you can see, I do not have any schedule for this, this, or this account. However, I do have a custom schedule for this account. When you look at your schedule, you can see how many posts you have scheduled for a particular day of week or day of month. You can also remove a particular item. This looks like a daily item, so if I removed this, it will remove it from every day because it was a daily post. So we support three different types of schedules, daily, weekly, and monthly. Let me show you how to create a new schedule. First of all, you have to select your library. Let's say others people content. Then you select the frequency to post. You could say uh, daily. So for your daily frequency, you can select the time. For instance, you want to post at 6 a.m. every day. Or you can ask Rick and Post to find the best day for you. For instance, sorry, best time. For by that, selecting this checkbox. Once you do that, we will find out the best time for you. The way we find best time is pretty simple. We look at your posting history and based on that we find out what of your what posts have been doing well and what time were they posted. Based on that we have an algorithm that gives positive or negative scores to every time slot. That's how we figured out what's the best time and we keep experimenting a little bit to continue to fine tune it. So you select your frequency and then you select your accounts. This, this, you can select as many accounts as you want. In the current situation it means I will be posting every day at best time other people's content library on these two accounts. So this means I will take one piece from this library and post at these two accounts. At what time? it will not be the same time. Why? Because the best time for my Twitter may not be the same time for my LinkedIn. So best time is calculated for every account separately. Once you click on add time slot, you will see what you have added here. If you wanted to let's say add one more time slot but only for this Twitter account, you could remove this and you can select, let's say you wanted to do weekly this time. So, on a Thursday, you want little extra post, one extra post to go on your Twitter. So, once on both accounts and on Twitter, one extra on Thursday. So, that's how it works to add a schedule. You can also do monthly, where instead of selecting day of week, you'll be selecting day of month. And that's how it works. If you guys have any questions, please do not forget to contact us by writing an email to support at rickerpost.com. Thank you.